Capital University, the latest college to join the debate over arming students. Tonight, concealed carry supporters in the student sentiment, Senate rather, held a meeting about allowing the students to carry guns. The university says it believes guns on campus would make students less safe. NBC4's Katie Farrell live at the university in Bexley with both sides of the story. Katie? Good evening. You know, right now, Capital University is a weapons free institution and it says it intends to stay that way. But some students say after the groping in the university library here behind me last week, they realize they're not as safe as they thought they were. And they say something's got to change. I feel as though I'm one who could be considered vulnerable. Capital University junior Haley Weiner says she'd feel a whole lot safer if she was allowed to carry a gun on campus. I'm just passionate about it because I'm a woman and I feel as though it's hard being on a college campus where assaults and attacks have been happening and I can't really protect myself. Weiner is one of a student bill sponsor. The proposal passed in the student Senate Tuesday night. Wednesday morning, the student president vetoed it. Capital University spokeswoman Nicole Johnson says it's willing to listen to students, but doesn't intend to change its gun free policies. Before we really looked to change that policy, we're certainly always open to dialogue, but before we change that policy, we would really have to study and have lots and lots of conversation about all of the different impacts, intended or unintended. Johnson says the university thinks guns on campus would hinder more than help. Our statistics show uh, consistency uh, year over year. We are a safe campus. We are not a perfect campus. There is no perfect campus. There's no perfect place. Crime happens everywhere. Wayner says campus doesn't feel as safe as it used to. It's been hard knowing that we're not as safe as we thought we were. And a man dubbed the serial groper was arrested for the crime inside of the library here. The bill sponsors say they intend to get a two thirds majority and that would mean they could override the student president's veto of their bill. We'll keep you posted what happens. Live in Bexley, Katie Farrell, NBC4. Thanks so much, Katie. Only one other Ohio college campus allows guns to be carried on campus. Cedarville University, that's a private school located outside of Dayton, enacted that policy last month. Students cannot carry guns, only university faculty, staff, and trustees who are approved by the school.